I've established my own research group here in the University of Limerick and I have research working with me uh, who come from various different uh, disciplines. We have people here uh, who have degrees in biomedical science, in science education, in industrial biochemistry and also in food science and health. Uh, this really reflects the multi-pronged approach that we're taking uh, against cancer. I'm particularly interested in breast cancer and colon cancer, uh, but the mechanisms that we use and are developing can be applied across all cancers. So we're using a series of uh, complementary and synergistic molecular approaches to fight this disease, and my research team are fiercely dedicated uh, to this fight. In Ireland, we have a big problem with cancer. Okay? We have 30,000 new cancer cases diagnosed every year. One in three people uh, are going to go on and develop cancer sometime in their lifetime. And cancer really is a debilitating disease. It has serious impact for patients, uh, for families, uh, for carers, and also for the economy and the healthcare system in general. But there's serious hope from the future, and I'm very excited about what we can do here at the University of Limerick. So UL has had the foresight uh, to lay down the foundations to allow us to establish applied and interdisciplinary research, and that's going to help our fight against cancer directly. So where do we stand now in terms of cancer? Well, right now, there's no real good one drug hits all cancer. We're making a lot of progress, and those progresses can be seen across leukemia, across breast cancer, and some lung cancers as well. Some people are researching uh, better ways to deliver drugs in cancer. Some people are researching better ways to diagnose cancer. What my research team is doing here is to, is to try and figure out how cancer spread. How is that metastatic process uh, taking place? And can we design new drugs that help us to block that cancer metastasis in its path? Because if we can do that, then we have a really good chance of developing novel therapies and new drugs uh, against cancer. So right now, as well as collaborating with national and international collaborators, um, my research team are also collaborating with several researchers across UL in the material science uh, area and also in microfluidics, um, uh, which is helping us uh, to develop better therapies and better molecular and cellular uh, approaches. What are the main challenges going forward? Well, in the cancer research field, what we need to do is to strive to get closer to patient-specific therapy. Uh, we need to prevent people from thinking that we know enough because we don't know enough. There is no magical cure around the corner. There might be a cure um, in, in 10, 20 years' time, but now, right, right now what we need to do is to make strides against cancer and make strides uh, bit by bit. Um, this is dependent on us being able to encourage public support, to be able to encourage uh, governmental support, and also to build and bring strong minds together um, on cancer research. And that's exactly what we're trying to do here as well.